how to measure a taper with hand tools. In this video I'm going to show you two different methods. Before we get started, please take a moment to like and subscribe. Okay, let's get started right now. For our first demonstration, we are going to need two 1, 2, 3 blocks, two dowel pins, they have to be the same size, and a micrometer. This is also the most accurate of the two methods. Okay, so I want to check this number four Morris standard to see if it actually is a number four Morris standard. It says right on there, so I'm pretty sure that it is. How can I check it using two dowel pins, two one, two, three blocks, and a micrometer? So what we're gonna do is put these up against, put the dowel pins up against here and here. Measure across here. you get your feel. So we're at two inches, 85 thou. Okay. Flip these up to the two inch part. So we measured at one inch. Now we're measuring at two inches. At two inches, 137 thou. Two inches, 137 thou minus two inches, 85 thou is 52 thou. A Morris taper has 52 thou per inch taper. So we went from one inch to two inches, so we measured the distance between one inch taper and a two inch taper, which turned out to be 52 thou. For this demonstration, we are going to use a digital dial caliper and a one, two, three block. This is the least accurate of the two methods, but it's also the easiest. Okay, so when you find yourself trying to measure an actual taper, can a taper be measured with vernier? I don't know. Let's see. So we know this is the number four, number four Morris taper because it's the standard. Can I measure this? So I have this one, two, three block here. I set it down. What I'm going to do is set the back side of my vernier, my digital caliper here, so it's being flat down. Move it across here, zero my dial out. When I get close enough, zero my dial out, go zero. Move to the two inch section here. Get it just the right feel. Come across here. Basically, 52 thou, a number four Morris taper, tapers up 52 thou per inch. So it is possible to measure a Morris taper with a vernier. And I shouldn't say vernier, with a digital dial caliper or any type of caliper. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below. Also, if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out. All you have to do is click on the icon on my face and I'll do the rest. And if you want to see other great videos, check out my YouTube channel, Shop and Math. Thank you for watching my video and have a great night.